Good morning, students. Today we are going to learn division algorithm for polynomials. Okay, in earlier classes or in first lesson we learned that division algorithm, that is Euclid division algorithm for integers. Okay, so we know that what is the division algorithm? That is dividend is equal to divisor multiplied by quotient. Plus remainder. Okay, so when we are finding HCF of two numbers, we already used this division algorithm for integers. Now we are going to learn division algorithm for polynomials. Okay, means if we divide any polynomial by another polynomial, okay, so we will get quotient and remainder as polynomial. Okay. Okay, first example is divide the polynomial f of x is equal to 14x cube minus 5x square plus 9x minus 1 by the polynomial g of x is equal to 2x minus 1 and also find the quotient and remainder. Okay, so we have to divide this polynomial f of x by g of x. So we have to divide this here we have to write dividend and here we have to write divisor. So here dividend is this, this polynomial and divisor is 2x minus 1. So we have to write 2x minus 1 here. Okay. And dividend is this. So 14x cube. If suppose in this dividend one of the term is missing. Suppose means x square term is not there. Directly 14x cube and 9x is there. So if x square term is not there, we have to write 0 x square. Okay. So here all terms are there. x cube is there, x square, x and constant term. Okay. So directly we have to write like this way 14 x cube minus 5 x square plus 9 x minus 1. Okay. Now first we have to divide this 14 x cube by 2 x. Okay, so that division I am writing here 14x cube divided by 2x. This first term divided by this first term 2x. Okay, so if we divide this, what we get x will be cancelled, 1x will get cancelled, 2 7s are 14. So here it is given 7x square. So this 7x square we have to write here. Now, by 7x square, we have to multiply these two terms. So, 7x square into 2x, that is a 14x cube. 7x square into minus 1, minus 7x square. Okay. Now, we have to subtract this polynomial from this polynomial. So, if we subtract this, sign will be changed. So, plus 14x cube. X cube becomes minus and minus 7x square becomes plus. So 14x cube minus 14x cube that is a 0. So this will get cancelled. Minus 5x square plus 7x square. So 7x square minus 5x square that is a 2x square plus 9x minus 1. Again, we have to divide this 2x square by 2x. So if we divide 2x square by 2x, this x will get cancelled, 2, 2 get cancelled, so what is remain on the x? So this x we have to write here, plus x, so sign is plus x. Then again same, this x we have to multiply to both terms, so x into 2x, 2x square, x into minus 1, minus x. Again we have to subtract, so here minus and here plus. 2x square minus 2x square will get cancelled. 9x plus x that is a 10x and this minus 1 as it is. Again 10x we have to divide by 2x. So if we divide 10x by 2x, 2 5s are 10. So answer is 5. So this 5 we have to write here. Again 5 we have to multiply to both terms. So 5 into 2x, 10x. 5 into minus 1, 
minus 5. If we subtract, sign will be changed. So this is minus and this is plus. So 10x will get cancelled. And minus 1 plus 5. That is 5 minus 1, 4. Okay. So here we will get remainder as a 4. And quotient as a 7x square plus x plus 5. Okay. So remember this every time degree of remainder is less than degree of divisor. Okay. So here degree of this is 0 because 4 we can write 4 into x raised to 0. So here degree of remainder is 0 because this is constant polynomial. So degree of remainder is 0 and degree of divisor is 1. So always remember that degree of remainder is always less than degree of divisor. Okay. And here we will get quotient times 7x square plus x plus 5 and r of x that is a q of x that is a quotient and r of x that is a remainder. So r of x is a 4. So we will get quotient as a 7x square plus x plus 5 and remainder as a 4. Okay. Now we will take second example. Okay. Second example is divide the polynomial f of x is equal to 6x cube plus 11x square minus 39x minus 65 by the polynomial g of x by the polynomial g of x x square minus 1 plus x also find the quotient and remainder okay so similarly we have to divide this is called long division so first i'm writing dividend 6x cube plus 11x square minus 39x minus 65 here all terms are there okay then g of x now here g of x is even x square minus 1 plus x so first we have to arrange the terms by ascending power of the x okay sorry descending power of x that is x square first then plus x then minus 1 ok now we have to divide this so first 6x cube we have to divide it by x square so again I am writing here 6x cube <coughs> divided by x square so what is it mean 6x ok so that 6x we have to write here that is a quotient now 6x we have to multiply all the three terms so 6x into x square 6x cube 6x into x that is a 6x square then 6x into minus 1 that is a minus 6x now we have to subtract this polynomial from f of x so 6x cube first change the sign so this is minus minus and plus so 6x cube minus 6x cube will get cancelled 11x square minus 6x square that is a 5x square minus 39x plus 6x that is a minus 33x and this minus 65 as it is again 5x square we have to divide by x square so 5x square if we divide by x square x square will get cancelled 5 again. so this 5 we have to write here now this 5 we have to multiply to all the terms so 5 into x square 5x square 5 into x plus 5x and 5 into minus 1 minus 5 now we have to subtract this so minus 5 x square minus 5x and plus 5 now subtract this 5x square minus 5x square will get cancelled minus 33x minus 5x that is minus 38x and minus 65 plus 5 that is minus 60 ok now after this we can't divide because here degree of remainder is less than degree of divisor so minus 38x upon x square we will get minus 38 upon x so this is not possible ok we want here 
portion is a polynomial so remainder we will get that is a r of x is equal to minus 38x minus 60 and q of x that is a portion is equal to 6x plus 5 okay third example is divide the polynomial u of x is equal to 9x raised to 4 minus 4x square plus 4 by the polynomial v of x is equal to 3x square plus x minus 1 also find the quotient and remainder okay so first we have to write here dividend and divisive now see here here cubic term is not there and linear term is not there means x cube and x is not there so instead of that we have to write 0x cube and 0x so 9x raised to 4 after that we have to write 0x cube because cubic term is not there so we have to write 0x cube then minus 4x square again linear term is not there means x is not there so we have to write 0 into x and plus 4 ok and this we have to write 3x square plus x minus 1 now first we have to divide 9x raised to 4 by 3x square ok so if we divide this x square is a man and 3 3 is a 9 so 3x square so we have to write here 3x square and we have to divide sorry we have to multiply 3x square to all these terms so 3x square into 3x square 9x raised to 4 3x square into x that is a 3x cube 3x square into minus 1 that is a minus 3x square ok now we have to subtract so first change this change the sign so this is minus this is minus and this is plus so 9x raised to 4 minus 9x raised to 4 will get cancel 0x cube minus 3x cube that is minus 3x cube 0 minus 3 that is minus 3 then minus 4x square plus 3x square that is minus x square and other terms as it is we have to write ok then minus 3x cube divided by 3x square so minus 3x cube divided by 3x square so 3 will get cancelled x cube by x square x and this minus n so minus x so we have to write with sign so minus x now minus x we have to multiply to all the three terms so minus x into 3x square minus 3x cube minus x into x that is minus x square minus x into minus 1 that is a minus x and sorry plus x minus x into minus 1 plus x now we have to subtract so change the sign this is plus plus and minus so minus 3x cube plus 3x cube will get cancelled minus x square plus x square will get cancelled 0x and minus x so 0 minus 1 that is minus x plus 4 ok after that we cannot divide here degree of remainder is 1 degree of divisor is 2 ok so after this we cannot divide so here remainder is that is r of x is minus x plus 4 and q of x is 3x square minus x ok understand everyone now we will take fourth example question 4 is divide the polynomial f of x is equal to 30x raised to 4 plus 11x cube minus 82x square minus 12x plus 45 48 by the polynomial g of x is equal to 3x square plus 2x minus 4 also find the quotient and remainder ok so same procedure we have to do here so first we have to write dividend that is 30x raised to 4 plus 11x cube minus 82x square minus 12x plus 14 so here all terms are there then divided by g of x that is 3x square 
plus 2x minus 4. Okay. So first we have to divide 30x raised to 4 by 3x square. So x square will get cancelled. So x square remain and 3 tens are 30. So 10x square. So first we have to write here. 10x square then multiply this 10x square to all these three terms so 10x square into 3x square 30x raised to 4 10x square into 2x so 10 to the 20 and x square into x that is a x cube then 10x square into minus 4 that is a minus 40x square okay now we have to subtract this so change the sign so minus minus and plus on this will get cancelled 11x cube minus 20x cube minus 9x cube minus 82x square plus 40x square so that is minus 42x square and other terms as it is that is minus 12x plus 48 now minus 9x cube we have to divide by 3x square so this will get cancelled x remain 3 3 is 9 and this minus so minus 3x so we have to multiply this minus 3x so minus 3x into 3x square minus 9x cube minus 3x into 2x minus 6 x square minus 3x into minus 4 uh, plus minus minus plus and this is 12x ok if we change the sign this is plus plus minus so 9x cube minus 9x cube plus 9x cube will get cancelled minus 42x square plus 6x square that is a minus 36x square and minus 12x minus 12x minus 24x plus 48 again now here degree of remainder and degree of divisor is same so we can divide this so minus 36x square if we divide by 3x square then x square will get cancelled 3 12 is 36 so minus 12 so here we have to write minus 2. So minus square into 3 x square that is minus 36 x square minus square into 2 x that is uh, minus 24 x and minus square into minus 4 it is a plus 48. So if we change the sign this become plus plus minus. So all will get cancelled and remainder is 0. So here R of x is 0 and Q of x is 10x square minus 3x minus 12. So here we will get remainder, here we get remainder is 0. Here we got remainder is 0. So this, this polynomial means divisor that is a factor of f of x. Okay. Remainder is 0 means this g of x is a factor of f of x. Okay. So r of x is we will get we got 0 and q of x is 10x square minus 3x minus 12. Okay. Now we will take one more example. So in that example we will find quotient and remainder and also we verify that division algorithm means this dividend is equal to divided multiplied by quotient plus remainder. Okay. Before going to take a next example, first write this division algorithm for polynomials. That is, if f of x and g of x are any two polynomials, means f of x is a dividend and g of x is a divisor. So, if these two are polynomials and if we divide f of x by g of x, where g of x not equal to 0, then we can find two polynomials that is q of x and r of x such that f of x is equal to g of x into q of x 
plus r of x means dividend is equal to divisor multiply by quotient plus remainder okay so where remainder is either it is zero or degree of remainder is always less than degree of g of x that is a degree of remainder is always less than degree of divisor okay and if r of x is equal to zero so uh, fourth example we saw that in that remainder is zero so g of x is a factor of f of x if remainder is zero then polynomial g of x is a factor of polynomial f of x okay so in notebook you have to write this first and then we will take next example okay the next example is divide the polynomial f of x is equal to 3x square minus x cube minus 3x plus 5 by g of x is equal to x minus 1 minus x square and verify the division algorithm okay so first we have to divide f of x by g of x we will get quotient and remainder and then we have to verify that division algorithm means f of x is equal to g of x into q of x plus r of x okay so first we will divide it now here these terms are not in proper order so first you have to write minus x cube okay you have to write terms in descending order okay so minus x cube then plus 3x square minus 3x plus 5 similar before divisor first we have to write minus x square then plus x and then minus 1 okay now we have to divide this so minus x cube divided by minus x square we get answer is x so here we have to write first x so x same to minus x square minus x cube x same to plus x that is a x square x same to minus 1 minus x now we have to subtract this so sign will be changed this becomes plus this is minus and this is plus so minus x cube plus x cube this will get cancel 3 x square minus x square 2x square minus 3x plus x that is minus 2x and plus 5 again 2x square we have to divide by minus x square so x square will get cancel so minus 2 remain so we have to write here minus 2 so minus 2 into minus x square 2x square minus 2 into x minus 2x And minus two into minus one, that is a plus two. So if we change the sign, that is minus plus and minus. This will get cancelled. Minus two x plus two x. This is also cancelled. Five minus two, that is a three. So here we will get r of x is equal to three. That is a constant polynomial. And q of x is equal to x minus two. Okay. now we have to verify division algorithm okay so first time writing what we have to verify that is to verify f of x is equal to g of x into q of x plus r of x okay so f of x that is the lhs lhs is equal to f of x that we have That is minus x cube plus 3x square minus 3x plus 5. Now RHS. So RHS is g of x into q of x plus r of x. So g of x that is minus x square. We are writing in brackets. G of x is minus x square plus x minus 1. Q of x that is x minus two and r of x is three. 
Okay, so we have to multiply this first. So x into minus x square minus x cube. X into x that is x square. X into minus one minus x. Now minus two we have to multiply all the three terms. So minus two into minus x square plus two x square minus two into x minus two x minus two into minus one plus two and this plus three as it is. Okay. Now minus x cube as it is x square plus two x square three x square minus x minus two x minus three x and two plus three is five. So you can see here yes, this LHS and RHS both are equal. Okay. Therefore, here we verified f of x is equal to g of x into q of x plus r of x. Okay. Now in next point, we will find uh, zeros of f of x by using this division algorithm. Okay.